It's easy to create a line chart with Excel. Very often all you have to do is just simply select your data with the mouse, click on insert, and choose the type of chart you want. And in this case we're doing time series charts. And then you can choose the type of chart you want. Now unfortunately sometimes Excel, when it does this, will put things in here we don't need like a, a legend. And so you might have to delete that or you might have to get rid of these um, grid lines here to clean it up a bit. And then you might have to do some things to uh, actually change the the chart a little bit and add some titles in here. So you might have to go to layout and add in your chart axis titles and so on. So it, it can get a little laborious to do all of that. So if I just delete that for a second. With Easy Chart, it's a free add-on, and you get all of this except for the histogram and the Pareto chart. If you want to purchase Easy Chart Plus, it's a little bit more money. But you can click on our line chart, and it'll go ahead and draw the chart, prompt you for titles. And in this case, we're doing Plant 1, and this might be 2013. And then this is, uh, let's say, number of defects or something. And so that'll create your chart. And then if you want to, it creates a separate chart sheet. You could actually move or copy this chart to another sheet or something of that nature. So it makes it really easy to draw a chart. You notice there's no extra grid lines, no extra exotic stuff here. All right. Now we could also take this bit of data and go to Easy Chart and say I want a line chart. And it'll put all of them on there and show us a good title and prompt us for all these other things. And in this case, yes, we definitely need a legend so that we can actually uh, tell all of these different lines apart. Now, if you want to, you can then change the formats of these things. Uh, you can change the line styles, all of the things that you can do with a regular Excel chart. Now, it's also possible to create what's called a line column chart. So it's a line and a column on two axes. And so here you'll see it on our easy chart menu, line column on two axes. So you just select two columns of data, click on line column. Again, it'll prompt you for titles. And it could be a type of category. In this case, we're doing some time, although I don't recommend this type of chart for time. And so that'll give you a line column chart. We could also take this data and under easy chart, we could show it as an area chart. So this will show the area under the curve. So those are the many types of charts that are available in EasyChart to do time series on charts and graphs. Now we also have some additional tools in EasyChart Plus, so if you need to do an, a run chart which adds an average or a median line in between, you can do that as well. And so here's our plot and here's an average line. So if you're going to need more exotic types of charts, I recommend that you go up to the QI macros. And we have all kinds of control charts in here that will assist you in drawing the types of charts that are needed for Six Sigma and statistical process control. So this will actually put in the average line plus show you where your process is out of control, as it is in this case. So that's how you draw time series charts using EasyChart.